one of the challenges that I face all the time with some of these students is anxiety and how I can help them yeah. see that they are, you know, they can do more than they think and that they're stronger than they know. How would you articulate or explain I, to them? I, you know how I do it. I'm yeah. doing it. I put pressure on the true answers. Yeah. Insecurity is the seed that creates all these issues. Absolutely. And so I'm trying to figure out why they didn't build self-esteem, who didn't build self-esteem, and the reason I bring up mom is like, Jesus, it's such a big percentage of it. Mom or dad is like 80% of it. It's just, you know, I do this a lot. I'm fascinated. Listen, my dad, listen, I don't talk a lot about this. That's what happened to my dad. My dad's, my dad, I'm so impressed by him. The way my grandmother parented my dad is unacceptable. That's the only word I can think of. So I'm fascinated by it because I had the reverse. I'm so perfectly parented by my mother, I'm unstoppable. I feel guilty that I'm so emotionally grounded and strong, that's why I'm giving it to you. That, like, what do you think's happening up here? I feel guilty that I have it so good mentally. There's nothing anybody can do to my mental state. It's insane. I am so weird, guys. <laughs> like, it, like, nothing hits, it's like I'm numb. And so, I go right to the core. I do it when I see it sometimes. I'm like, hey, you are unbelievable and you think you're shit, that's bad. We need to talk about this. Tell me everything about your childhood. <laughs> like, you know, and I just go there and you know, sometimes you get a little break, sometimes, but what's really fun is they start thinking about it and it changes behavior. I get an email every day that says that they disconnected from somebody in their inner circle and for the last six months they've, they've, they're breathing for the first time in their lives. It is not easy to break up with your brother. It is not easy to break up with your spouse. It is not easy to break up with your father. But that's actually the binary move if they're the poison of your life. So, A, if that's your reality, you need to think. Because guess what? You have one life. And you don't want to be 73 when your parent passes away and finally start breathing. B, if that is not your life, you need to drive home right now and kiss your parents in the face.